Cy Brandon, NASM Certified Personal Trainer, and today we're going to teach you guys how to do deadlift with proper form. This is a fundamental exercise that will be really be beneficial in helping you build muscle mass and size. Uh, however, it can also be dangerous if you don't perform it correctly. So we're going to show you how to do it correctly with proper form today so that you can do it hopefully injury free. Uh, last thing you want to do is injure your back and take you out of the gym or everyday life for a while. So we're going to be targeting gluteus maximus glutes, your hamstrings, your quadriceps, adductor magnus, uh, erector spinae along your back, and your upper traps are the muscles that are going to be worked throughout this lift. So let's get right into it. When setting up for the deadlift, there are a couple key things to keep in mind. First off is your foot placement. Toes should be pointed straight ahead, your knees in line with the second and third toes, and your foot should be about halfway underneath the bar as you see here. The next thing you want to think about is your shoulder position. You're going to want to retract and depress your shoulders in order to set up for the optimal deadlift. You will then grab the bar a little bit wider than the shoulder width apart, keep your chest up, and push through your heels. Think about the first half of the movement as a leg press and the second half as a hip thrust. You're pushing off the ground, not pulling. The most important thing to remember when doing deadlift is to maintain a neutral spine, aka a flat back. If your back begins to arch at any point while deadlifting, lower the weight and work on form before increasing again. Finally, the goal is to keep the barbell as close to your body as possible. The bar should follow up your shins, up your quads to the top position. If you follow these steps and procedures, you will not only help prevent injury, but you'll progress faster when performing this lift. The most common mistake you'll see in the gym when it comes to deadlift is not squatting down deep enough and therefore compensating with your back. As you can see here, my back is rounded. I'm asking for a back injury, herniated disc, you name it. It's gonna be painful. Next you see here is the shoulder shrug and bicep curl. People kind of shrug their shoulders as they come up to bring the bar up and kind of curl. You're asking to tear a bicep and it's just a very inefficient form of movement. In recap, your feet should be about shoulder width apart, toes pointed straight ahead, and knees in line with the second and third toes. Bar should be about over your midfoot. You're then going to retract and depress your shoulders, grip the bar a little bit wider than shoulder width apart, push through your heels, and have a bar path as close to your body as possible. So the bar will follow up your shins, up your quads to the top position. While maintaining a neutral spine, back should remain flat, no arching, as this leads to injury. If you follow these steps and principles, you'll have a successful deadlift and progress fast. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to leave a like and a comment if you enjoyed it.